start, we start out in the periphery as we always do, and there are three types of fibers, roughly speaking, that we have to talk about. Um, the A beta fibers, which are, are wide, di high, wide diameter, uh, well myelinated uh, fibers. A delta fibers, which are thinner and, and less well, they're lightly myelinated. And then C fibers, which are unmyelinated fibers. And these are going to conduct information at uh, very, uh, the A beta fibers are, can go as fast as, say, 100 meters per second, whereas the A delta fibers go around 30 meters per second tops. And C fibers go typically under one meter per second. And so from the, from this, from the uh, fingertip to the dorsal column nucleus, that would take 10 to 30 milliseconds for an A beta fiber, 25 to 160 milliseconds for an A delta fiber, and then over a second for a C fiber. And so that, what that tells you is that the information carried in these different um, types of fibers it are, is traveling really at really, really different speeds. You, as you may um, imagine, that the fastest fibers are those that are involved in movement, motor control. So you don't want to fall, and you need to learn about that tree root that's in your path that you're about to stumble over. You need to learn about that earlier rather than later. So touch, proprioception, vibration, all of that comes in through A beta fibers. A delta fibers carry information about things such as um, pinprick. Uh, and, and so very what we call fast pain. And then C fibers carry information about duller pain, uh, 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 an ache an achy pain, um, information about temperature changes, and also information, interestingly enough, about what, what people are calling pleasurable touch, so sensual touch. Uh, there are, in fact, a lot of touch fibers that, that, go, um, uh, that travel in C fibers, but most of them are, are not, they're not involved in motor control. The motor control involved uh, fibers are the A beta fibers. So within these different fiber types, there are different types of fibers. So there's a, a, a type of fiber that only detects vibration or a type of fiber that only detects touch but rapidly adapts, and another one that only detects touch but slowly adapts. And each of these has a particular percept that it results in. So you have a percept of vibration or per percept of a light touch or percept of pressure. And there is a rough alignment between a single fiber type and that feeling, but the alignment is not, um, is not exact. And in fact, anything that where you don't have the full complement of all the fibers involved will not feel natural. It'll feel off. It'll feel weird. Um, there are also sensations that are compound sensations, sensations where there have to be two different sensations that are built within the central nervous system into an interpretation. And the best example of that is wetness. Wetness is a combination of touch and cold. Okay? So if you, if you get into a pool and that pool is at skin temperature, it will not feel wet. You have to have a combination of touch with cold. And if there's no cold stimulus, you won't, it won't feel wet. Now, there's one final um, point that should be made. So when we look at the fibers that are in the peripheral nerves, one, an, an, one natural uh, assumption is that they're all sensory. They are not all sensory. There are very fast fibers that um, take the uh, accent, they, are the axons of motor neurons carrying information going out to skeletal muscles. And there are also a lot of C fibers that are sympathetic uh, efferents going out to, say, sweat glands and out to the cutaneous blood vessels. So some of the diseases that affect, uh, there are, are inherited 
neuropathies that affect selective groups of fibers based on size, based on developmental history, and we've seen one of those, and um, in that case, it, it, the congenital insensitivity to pain, we're gonna look at that again, and um, in that case, the C fibers that go out to sweat glands may also be affected as well. Now let's move on to, to actually think about what pain is and talk about what uh, the, the broad, the, an overview of nociceptions. <music>